It is time for Coffee with Corey. How about we solve a national crisis this I'm morning? I'm down for that. Absolutely. We have okay. plenty of time. We have like two and a half minutes here. Definitely not our own. <laughs> down in New Zealand, they're having some tough times, and I'm not sure exactly how we can help here in America, but by golly, if there's one thing Americans can agree on, it's that, well, most of us are willing to help out someone in need. Sure. What's should. happening in New Zealand that has the nation reeling? 16 days ago, someone stole Charisma the Alpaca uh -oh. from a property in Dairy Flat, no less. Sickening. You might be sitting there saying, Corey, I'm an animal lover too, but stolen alpaca? How is this a national crisis? Oh, you just wait. Charisma was stolen. That's horrible. This just isn't any alpaca. Take a look. What? His blind brother Bambi needs him back. You're kidding. He cannot navigate the paddock without him. I looked up a paddock. It's a small enclosure. <laughs> Folks, let me just recap the scenario here. In New Zealand, we have the theft of not only an alpaca, not only the theft of an alpaca with a blind brother named Bambi, but the theft of an alpaca with a blind brother named Bambi who cannot function without his brother's guidance around the paddock. Oh, dear. That is a crisis. Go ahead. Sit on your couch and think, well, this isn't a national emergency by New Zealand standards. It is. And listen, uh, how seriously the North Shore Rodney West Auckland Police Department is taking this. Come on people, we need to find this alpaca. For the sake of the family and for the sake of this little guy. Did you, did you add that music? No, they did. <laughs> Come on people, we need to find this alpaca. Now, you may care now. But you're sitting there wondering, well, what can we do in America? Well, there's plenty. Uh, first, as you already know, the International Alpaca Trafficking Network knows no borders. So if you see an alpaca for sale that isn't from around here, don't buy it. Report it immediately. How can you tell if an alpaca is from New Zealand and not America? They have a New Zealand accent, of course. <laughs> Secondly, oh, well, I guess that's about all we can do. Um, <laughs> I suppose we could send some alpaca That's eggs it. down to New Zealand to replace charisma. Alpacas are hatched, right? <sighs> yeah. uh, I know we can't do much in America, but good luck to the North Shore Rodney West Auckland Police Department in their search for charisma. And if there's anything I can do to help, please let me know. Alpaca my bags and head right down. <laughs> Don't steal alpacas. Come Remember on, people. This. We need to find this alpaca for the sake of the family and for the sake of this little guy. Oh, I don't know. Wow. I, I don't know how you did all that with a straight face, but well done, Corey. Well done. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Corey. And I hope they find charisma. I do, too. For his too, brother's actually. Bambi's sake. Absolutely. Yeah. All right. 827 coming up here this morning on Good Day.